A complete screen analysis is performed to obtain the precise data that forms the basis for engineering calculations. In order to perform this complete analysis, screens of different mesh sizes are stacked in order of size from coarsest at the top to finest at the bottom. A known quantity of ore is put on the top screen and the entire stack is then put on the row tap machine. This machine shakes and taps the screens for about 20 minutes. During this process, the fine particles fall through most of the screens and accumulate on the bottom screens, while the coarser particles stay toward the top. Once the screening is complete, the material on each screen is collected. The results from this analysis can be plotted on a graph. The horizontal axis represents the size in microns, and the vertical axis gives the percent of particles that pass through a screen of a given size. To build this graph, first the amount of material that passed through the finest screen is weighed. The finest screen in this case is a 400 mesh or 38 micron screen. The weight is divided by the total weight we began with to give the percent of particles that passed through the screen. In this case, 12.1% of the particles passed through the 38 micron screen. This point is plotted on the graph. For the next point, the percent of all particles that pass through the second finest screen is calculated. In this case, 15.1% of particles passed through the 53 micron screen. The second point is plotted on the graph. Each point is built in the same way. The fraction of particles that pass through each screen is determined and plotted on the graph. We continue building the rest of the graph in the same way until all the material is weighed. The graph is known as a cumulative size distribution curve.